and I'm back again with another video. So I, I guess this video is gonna be like a celebration video, kind of, because uh, I I made it a full year at my current job. Yeah, uh, yeah. Earlier in in February uh, was my one year anniversary of working at, at my current job. Uh, it, it's the first time I made a full year uh, uh, at any job, consecutively, I should say. I, I've mentioned this before, uh, uh, until now I've never worked at the same job for a year, uh, but if you added up all the time I worked at uh, the mountain resort in winter and summer, then uh, I'm sure it would be uh, over a year. So, so yeah, but, but yeah, this current job, uh, it's, it's, you know, it's a full year with no breaks. Uh, in in it, and I, I'm right now. I'm 30, 32 years old. So yeah, I've got uh, something else checked off on uh, my life goals, I guess, or or something. I I completed something that uh, other people have already done in life. But, uh, but, yeah, but I, I don't really care. While, while I, I haven't worked at other jobs very long, I, I, I like the, the new experience, actually. And, and I, I have worked at some cool places, so, so yeah, yeah, that's a little better than working at the same exact job your whole life. But, but yeah, but I'm, yeah, still glad I made a full year at one job in my life. Uh, and yeah, that all being said, I want to get a new job. <laughs> uh, you know, not, not because I, I don't like it or any, or I, or I don't like the people. I, I like the people and, and. It, it, it is a, a great company to work for. They, they actually even sent me a card in the mail uh, congratulating me on working a, a year. That was nice of them. And, but, but yeah, like, like I've said a hundred times before, I'm, I'm just working a job that I don't want to do the rest of my life. And I also don't want to move up, you know, the, the corporate ladder, I, I guess, like, I get, yeah, I can probably start asking about, like, what it would take for me to move up the ranks and get, get like, a, an assistant manager job, but I, I want to be an assistant manager or a manager, uh, yeah. Yeah, so I am looking for other work, and I almost got a, a new job to not too long ago. Uh, I got an interview with a local TV news station for a production assistant job, which I've done a lot of production assistant jobs for television shows and movies uh, and commercials too. Uh, but I never heard back from uh, the, the guy I interviewed with, so I didn't get, the, get that job, which sucks because you know, even though it wouldn't be my dream job, it would have been a lot closer to like what I want to do for the rest of my life, and it would have also like been in my field of study that I went to college for. Yeah, yeah, and I even 
consent uh, the uh, interviewer, I guess that's what you call him. But yeah, I sent the guy a follow-up email thanking him for interviewing me, and uh, I said how much I would like to get the job and how much it would mean to me. Yeah. But the, yeah, like I said, the guy never got back to me. Yeah. Didn't even email me back saying that he had received the, my follow up email. Which is uh, something that I have done before. Like someone would send me an email or a text and I would read it and then not send anything back to them. So <laughs> now I know how it feels. But, I am, uh, you know, uh, trying to change that and uh, let them know that I got what they sent me when people send me something. Uh, yeah, and I, I wish I could ask the guy who interviewed me why he didn't hire me. Uh, so then I could work on what I did wrong and change it and hopefully get the next job. Yeah, I've had quite a few uh, job interviews uh, with local TV news stations. I've had at least two job interviews with the same guy. Uh, it's, he, he remembered me from the last time uh, we interviewed. Yeah, I think the interviews were year apart, something like that. And and I, I, I know I had at least another job interview at the same station, but was another person. Yeah, yeah, and I, I think I also had a, a phone interview with a different TV news station, probably close to 10 years ago now at this point uh, so yeah so it seems like I can get job interviews relatively easy but just can't get the, the job and uh, the you know the production assistant job or, or PA job as they're often called it, it would have been a full-time job yeah yeah yeah, eight hours a day, five days a week, so. Yeah, yeah, that would, would not have been like my other PA jobs where it was just for a couple days or a weekend or even just one day. Yeah, I'm bummed that I didn't get that job. Yeah, yeah, it, it's something I would have enjoyed doing. Unlike all of the customer service jobs that I've done, I, I just keep getting customer service jobs because I've worked these types of jobs before, so I have experience uh, doing these jobs. So that makes it easier to get these kinds of jobs, but. I still don't like doing these jobs. Well, I, I like some jobs more than others, I should say, but you know, still, I, I should have gone into another line of work, like, you know, uh, like working in an office. If I had an office type job, then I wouldn't have to deal with customers. Uh, and, and then also maybe I could uh, work from home. Uh, yeah, that might be a good thing. Uh, I've never worked uh, any of my jobs from home because they all can't be worked from home. You know, you know I need to be at a location to do my job. Yeah, yeah, maybe 
I don't know, sometime before 2020, I could have moved into the white collar, is that the term? White collar type jobs, worked in an office and then also worked from home now since so many other companies are offering that. Yeah, my, my life probably would have been a little different if I had tried to, uh, I don't know, I guess, pivot. Pivot! 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 From uh, the uh, customer service jobs to more corporate office style jobs. Yeah, would have been different for sure. Uh, yeah, it's almost the thing about. But uh, what what can you do now? I don't know. For my current job, it's it's good. Yeah, I can still do it, and I kind of still need to do it because I need money. Uh, but yeah, I'm still gonna be on the lookout for a job that's uh, more in line with my college degree. Cause I, yeah, I don't want to just leave this job that I, 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 I don't want to say love, but you know, I, I like more than other jobs. And yeah, yeah, I don't want to leave it and then maybe the other, uh, just a worse consumer service job. Uh, so yeah, yeah, that's gonna be it for this vlog because I'm just kind of rambling now, but. Yeah, so, wow, <laughs> wow, I think the, the sun went behind the cloud or, or something, it's, yeah, now I can see my shadow behind me, yeah, I do have the light on me, my own uh, personal uh, light, uh, but uh, yeah, but I was, I was using the sun for most of my light, so yeah, so now it looks like there's a spotlight on me. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't paying attention to that, but well, yeah, so uh, until next video, goodbye.